It was one of the greatest individual performances in college football history, and it happened Saturday afternoon in Norfolk. Old Dominion quarterback Taylor Heineke broke seven NCAA records while becoming the first player in history to combine for 791 yards, a game for the ages. I'm Bruce Rader, and people around the nation are still talking about Old Dominion's 64-61 win over New Hampshire Saturday, a win that moved the Monarch up to fourth in the nation and number one on the highlight reels. Coach Bobby Wilder and his team were facing what looked to be their first loss of the season and their first conference game of the year. New Hampshire had a 23-point lead in the third quarter when Heineke put on a show that people will be talking about for years. Never have I seen Coach Bobby Wilder at a loss for words. We almost saw him that way Saturday after that remarkable comeback. Yeah, 55 for 79 for 730 yards, five touchdowns. I, I can't even believe I'm saying those numbers. And then he ran the ball for 60 yards, and he just keeps getting better uh, every game. And, and to think that he's only played 13 of them is, is pretty impressive. Heineke, only a sophomore, showed the poise of a veteran, changing plays at the line of scrimmage, never losing his school. He was in so much demand today, the school scheduled him his own media conference, something the reserve quarterback is not used to. But Saturday, Taylor, you had to be excited then. It was, it was unreal. Um, again, in the first half, you know, we were down by that many points. We've never been in that situation before. Um, and again, we knew that our offense could you know, strike at any point very quickly. And um, again, I know our def defense is capable of playing very well. And, um, you know, I saw all these all these fans leaving the stands, and I was just like, uh, and it really made me mad. So, um, you know, I just some got into me, and you know, I think everyone on the team got some a little something into them, and they wanted to make this comeback. And uh, you could just see it in everybody that you know we could do it. So um, it, it was a, it was an awesome thing to be a part of. You know what, Taylor? I'll bet those fans don't leave early again. By the way, you can see his complete media conference from this afternoon. Go to wavy.com and click on sports. And you know we'll be talking about it Friday night at 1045 with Coach Wilder on the Old Dominion Football Show on Fox 43.